Well, plenty of rain and some embedded storms across the area this afternoon. And <clears throat> pardon me, it's going to stay with us for a while. Let's put the radar satellite, uh, well, just the radar in motion. And this is over a two hour period. You can see on and off soaking rains across the area, heaviest of which down toward Vermilion Parish, moving into Iberia Parish and the northernmost parishes of Acadiana. But it looks like we're going to see a little bit of a break coming up as we head through the early evening hours. But more rain and storms in southeast Texas will be building eastward with more action as we get into the wee morning hours. And on top of that, there could be a low end severe weather threat as we head through the midnight to four to 5 a.m. time frame as showers and storms slowly move across the area and then they're going to linger. This is just the next 15 hours or so and look at that rainfall as we look at the overnight rains. Generally one to two inches of rain possible. Isolated areas will see less and a few spots may see closer to three inches of rain and then we have another batch of rain on the way for tomorrow night. So we got plenty of rain on the way. Your rain chance numbers highest right now. They drop off a little bit then they pick back up into the 70 80 percent range. Then they drop back off a little bit during the day tomorrow, and that's how we're going to play it with rain chances ramping back up for tomorrow evening. So a good soaking overnight tonight, a cloudy day tomorrow with a few passing showers, maybe a thunderstorm, and then rain chances ramping up again tomorrow night. Details on all the rain totals and what we can expect severe weather-wise and the complete TrueView forecast coming up in just a, sh a few short minutes.